ladies and gentlemen let's give a huge round of applause ladies and gentlemen parents teachers and our wonderful students tonight we are not just gathered as a school but as a community united by the spirit of unity dedication and celebration speaking of dedication and celebration we have a performance the remember is the essence of sportsmanship perseverance and grandeur of the olympics the olympics spirit of unity excellence and the pursuit of dreams this performance is not just a dance it is the tribute to the athletes who inspire us with their passion and determination papa how did sports in india go from struggling to win medals to celebrating success at the olympics well honey it's a story of dedication perseverance and a collective dream for excellence it all began with a few visionaries who believed in the power of sports to transform our nation who were they papa jan chand pt usha and many more these were trail blazers who laid the foundation but the turning point came with the establishment of sports academies and a focus on grassroots development and then we started winning medals at the olympics it took time the mindset around sports began to change parents started supporting their children's dreams of becoming athletes corporates started sponsoring athletes enabling them to focus on training without financial constraints that's amazing papa i have read about how athletes started receiving more support absolutely remember hockey team abhinobindra vijender singh mary com saina nehwal pv sindhu and finally neeraj chopra winning the gold in javelin throw at the olympics these were historic moments not just for them but for the entire nation it showed that with the right support and determination we could compete and win at the highest level it's an inspirational transformation papa yes indeed get ready to be enthralled other talented students take the stage to perform an olympic themed dance that will transport you to the heart of games so without further ado let the energy and rhythm of olympic spirit fill the air as we present to you a spectacular dance performance let's all give a huge round of applause as the students of grade 6 are ready to rock the stage
technology like the led smart tvs represent the modern era television technology papa 
Did you really watch TV in black and white? That sounds so ancient. Of course, when I was your age, our television was black and white. Watching a cricket match or a movie in black and white was a different experience altogether. But why? Why didn't you have color TV? Color TVs were luxury and black and white TVs were more affordable. It wasn't until the late 1980s and early 1990s that color TVs became more common in households. Wow, that must have been a big transformation. It was indeed. I remember the first time we got a color TV at home. It was like a magical transformation. What about advertisements, Papa? Were they different on black and white TVs? You are right. Advertisements were simpler, less flashy, and focused more on the message. With the advent of color TV, everything changed. Advertisements became more vibrant, creative, and captivating. Do you miss the simplicity of the black and white TVs, Papa? There's a certain charm to it, but I appreciate the advancements. The transformation from black and white to color was more than just a change in technology. It was a shift in how we perceive the world. It made entertainment more immersive and brought a new level of excitement to our lives. Dear parents, we request you to go back and to be please be seated. The other audience, whoever is at the back of you, are not able to see, and they are requesting you to ask you to request you to go back. We we are able to still see that you are standing. We are still able to see. అందరి uh, పేరెంట్స్ కు ఒక రిక్వెస్ట్ ఏంటంటే దయచేసి మీరు కూర్చోండి కూర్చున్నట్లయితే వెనకాల ఉన్న ప్రేక్షకులు చూస్తారు మీరు నిల్చొని కెమెరాలు పట్టుకున్నట్లయితే పేరెంట్స్ వెనకాల కూర్చున్న వాళ్ళు వాళ్ళు కూడా పేషెన్స్ గా వెయిట్ చేసి వాళ్ళ పిల్లల యాక్టింగ్ కూడా చూడాలనుకుంటున్నారు దయచేసి మీరు కూర్చోండి మేము మీకు హెచ్డి క్వాలిటీ వీడియోస్ తో పాటు ఫొటోస్ కూడా ఇస్తాం కంపల్సరీ షేర్ చేస్తాం ట్రస్ట్ మీ కైండ్లీ అవాయిడ్ ద టేకింగ్ ఫోటోగ్రాఫ్స్ అండ్ స్టాండింగ్ నియర్ టు దిస్ బారికేడ్స్ థ్యాంక్ యూ ఈ నగరానికి ఏమైంది ఓ వైపు నుసి మరోవైపు పొగ ఎవరు నోరు మీద పరేంటి దీన్ని మౌనంగా ఎందుకు భరించాలి ఈ నిర్లక్ష్య ధోరణికి పాడాలి చరమ గీతం
पेश में नमक है दस में से आप डेंटिस्ट की पसंद है ये करते हैं मसाला दुनिया से डरते हैं उल्टी सीधी चलते हैं आप क्लोजअप क्यों नहीं करते हैं क्या आपकी नाजुक त्वचा पे डाका खुजली होती है क्या गोरे बन के चक्कर में रोज आपकी बेटी रोती है क्या आपकी पत्नी कपड़े साधारण साबुन से धोती है क्या आप अपने शिशु को देती है पौष्टिक कहा चुभती जल्दी गर्मी का मौसम आया दादा चलते तो मास दादा हिलते तो मास दादा देखे तो मास मम मास फिर से बोलो Tell me about how cricket evolved in India after independence. I mean, how did we go from playing at local grounds to something as big as the IPL? Ah, uh, honey, it's a passion, a way of life. After independence, we had great players like Vijay Hazare and Lala Amarnath who laid the foundation. But things really started to change in 1980s. How so, Papa? Television played a significant role. The introduction of televised matches brought cricket into our homes, making heroes out of our players. And then came 1983 World Cup win. Kapil Dev and his team became national icons overnight, and the love for cricket reached new heights. So the 83 World Cup was a turning point. It instilled a belief in Indian cricket. The young generation saw that we could conquer the cricketing world. The momentum continued through 90s with legends like Sachin Tendulkar, 
Rahul Dravid and Saurav Ganguly emerging. And then came the IPL, right? Yes, the IPL changed everything. It brought glamour, entertainment and international players to our own stadiums. The format of T20 cricket added a new exciting dimension, making it a thrilling spectacle for fans. I would love to become a cricketer too. Can I? Of course, honey. Yes, you can. It's not just about playing the game, it's about breaking barriers and challenging stereotypes. I'm happy, Papa. The cricket field was not just a place for men. It was a space where dreams, talent and determination knew no gender. Yes, honey. The transformation of cricket in India is a testament to resilience, skill and passion of our players. Are you ready to witness nation's cricketing glory? Yes, I'm in. Stay tuned as we explore India's cricketing milestones, culture, impact, and its race as a dominant force in the sport. Let's, Let's all, all welcome our grade nine and ten students with a huge round of applause.
अपना है दिल ये आज का दुनिया से जाके बोल दो बोल दो ऐसे जागो रे साथियों दुनिया की आंखें खोल दो खोल दो लहरा दो लहरा दो सरकशी It's a prestigious achievement and an honor to win the World Cup for our country. The dancers have accurately presented the whole story of cricket progress in India. Let's thank the dancing dancers who brought the spirit of the World Cup onto the stage. Please, Please make, make some noise by applauding cheerfully for the spectacular World Cup dancers. Hey buddy, can I ask you one question? Surely buddy, please ask. Do you have any problems in your locality? Definitely my friend, numerous issues are there. Rightly said. Social issues have widespread impact on the well-being of individuals and communities. Social issues can manifest in culture, political, economic or even environmental challenges. Honey, what did you do in your group discussion session today? Ha yeah, papa, we talked about various reforms that have taken place over the years like the abolition of untouchability, the women's empowerment initiatives and more. Yes, the eradication of untouchability was a significant step towards creating more inclusive society. How did your class perceive these reforms? Yes, Papa. We discussed how there have been strides in promoting education for girls and increasing their participation in various fields. It's great that you are having these discussions. Understanding our history of reforms helps us envision a better future. I will, Papa. Thanks for discussing this with me. Any time, honey. If you ever want to dive deeper into these topics, I am here to help. Keep learning and questioning things. That's how progress is made. To define these social issues in the art reform, may I call upon the performers of grade six and seven. Dear audience, stay tuned. Let the dance begin. Chinnari thalli, chinnari thalli, na ningi jabili.
Education is the most powerful weapon through which we can bring about a change in the society. Yes, Raiksha, I do agree with you. Kushal, shall we know more about the right to education in the story? Yes, we shall. Hey honey, how was your social class at school? As you always complain, was it boring? Ah, Papa, it was good. We had an interesting discussion in class today about the right to education in India. Oh, that sounds exciting. What did you learn about it? We learned that the right to education in India is a fundamental right for children between the ages of 6 to 14 under the right of children to free and compulsory education, RTE Act 2009. That's spot on. Education shapes individuals and society as a whole. I feel fortunate to have the opportunity to learn and grow through education. I wish every child could have the same access without any barriers. That's a wonderful perspective, honey. We should always value the privilege of education. Absolutely, Papa. I'm glad we had this conversation. It made me to appreciate the value of education even more. Me too, sweetheart. Keep learning, growing and never forget the importance of education in shaping a better tomorrow. Celebrating the essence of learning, our next performance space, Tribute to the right to education. A dance for train, transformative power of learning. Let's witness the magic unfold. Let's applaud this beautiful expression of knowledge and empowerment. भारत वर्ष में प्रारंभ से ही बच्चों को ईश्वर का रूप माना जाता है। ईश्वर के बाल रूप, यथा बाल गणेश, बाल गोपाल आदि, इसके प्रत्यक्ष उदाहरण हैं। लेकिन आज की तस्वीर इससे बिल्कुल अलग है। है कीमती बच्चे फिर भी क्यों नंगे पैर ये सड़कों पर भीख मांगते हैं अपनी किस्मत की रेखा चूटे बर्तनों में घिसते हैं घर बाजार वासना के हाथों रोज बिकते हैं हम रोज ये सुनते पढ़ते और देखते और सो जाते हैं चलो देर से ही सही अब जाग जाते हैं और इन बच्चों को इनका हक दिलाते हैं भीगी भीगी सी है राते भीगी भीगी यादे भीगी भीगी बाते भीगी भीगी आँखों में कैसी नमी है सपनों का साया पल को पे आया पल में हँसाया पल में रुलाया फिर भी ये कैसी कमी है
मैथ्स में रूल्स नहीं है सिर्फ जादू तो तैयार हो मेरे बेस्ट फ्रेंड मैथ्स से दोस्ती करने के लिए दो मुर्गी तेरी दो मुर्गी मेरी चार तेरे मामे की सात सुर में जो तीन ताल मिले धुन बने गाने की दुनिया है सारी नंबरों से बनी बक्से से बाहर निहार हम नजर अभी कीड़ किताबी टेंशन मत ले आ बोलो बेटा एक दो तीन चार तो डर ना क्या मेरे यार बोलो बेटा तू टेंशन मत ले These talented performers have not only graced us with their artistry, but have also dedicated their time and effort to convey the importance of education through their mesmerizing choreography. Each movement, each formation, is a testament to the transformative power of education. Let's all give a thunderous round of applause to our dance team for their dedication, passion, commitment to spread awareness about right to education. This dance not only entertained us, but also advocated for change and support that ensure education to all. Once again a thunderous round of applause for our incredible dance team. Dear audience, today we have a special treat for you. A dance performance that beautifully encapsulates the spirit of our diverse nation. Yes, we are talking about unity in diversity. Absolutely. Our talented slokais are been working tirelessly to bring a performance that showcases the rich and vibrant cultures of India. So let's dive right into it. Picture this: a stage filled with colors, rhythms, and the stories of different regions coming together. Wow! It's like living, breathing a cycle of cultures. And our performers are about to bring it to life. Honey, imagine India as a beautiful butterfly. A butterfly? How? Yes, just like a butterfly with colorful wings. Each wing represents the diversity of our country. different states religions languages and cultures oh i get it like the wings of the butterfly are different but together they make it fly exactly our diversity is like a vibrant patterns on the wings and the body of butterfly that's our unity So if one wing is different the butterfly might not fly well Precisely it's the balance and cooperation of both wings that make butterfly soar Similarly in India our unity in diversity is what makes us strong and beautiful India is like a butterfly with so many colors papa That's my girl always seen the beauty in things our diverse colors make india truly incredible speaking of which let us not keep our audience waiting any longer the audience get ready to witness the magic as our students showcase the beauty of unity and diversity through their mesmerizing dance 
Let's all give a huge round of applause as we call upon the students of grade 8, 9 and 10 for a beautiful dance presentation on the theme Unity in Diversity. Okay. Come now, follow my lead. Come, come now, follow my lead.
Bubba Rex, ayy. Couple Grammys on him, couple plaques, ayy. That's a fact, ayy. Throw it back, ayy. Throw it back, ayy. Honey, have is the story of transformation of butterfly in my different way? It was incredible and now I understand the real transformation of India. Hmm. Papa, I'm so proud to be an Indian and I love you, Papa. Do you know that? Okay, honey. I know. I love you too. You want to sleep now? I want to sleep now. Mm, I love the story, Papa. I'm inspired. I'm proud to be an Indian. Thank you. Honey, how sweet dreams. Good night. Sleep while I sing 